Hi guys and welcome to how to succeed in a data protection officer role course, one that adds more practicality into how to address the DPO role. My name is Roland Costilla, I will be your instructor and if you are not already enrolled in Build EU GDPR Compliance from Scratch course, I do recommend to do so because that course represents the basics on which all my other courses are built onto. In this video, I would like to introduce you to our course synopsis and the roadmap I am proposing for mastering the DPO role. The course starts with the introduction where you can find more details about my experience and why you should trust and start learning privacy with me. In section 2, we will discuss briefly about the DPO role, skills needed, hiring errors companies make, when it is mandatory to hire a DPO and when voluntary makes more sense. Section 3 includes the initiation of the role, first tasks and first days in the role, what resources you would need and different documentation or contracting requirements, while Section 4 goes for GDPR compliance tasks related to the DPO role. This include legal basis, data processing obligations, consent, processor versus controller, data breaches, initial assessment and internal audits. In section 5, we will continue with risk-related DPO tasks including risk identification, analysis, evaluation and treatment and we will define the concept of data protection impact assessment or DPIA. Technical assessments are further analyzed in section 6 including ISO or NIST related controls, data breaches, responses and severity, while DPO tasks outside European Union is the topic for our last section, section 7. So here we go, let's start our DPO journey with the next lesson.